Hello and welcome to Live in My Left Life DIY Creations channel. For today's DIY project, Nico and I are transforming a dollar store heart wreath into a super simple feather boa wreath for Valentine's Day. Don't forget to like, share and follow below. So grab yourself a coffee and let's begin, shall we? Okay, supplies needed. Tinsel heart wreath, feather boa times five, a neon pink string light, two AA batteries, ribbon, foam heart accessory, pipe cleaners, scissors, glue gun, and glue sticks. Okay, so step one, remove the tinsel from the heart frame, which I've already done, uh, just to speed this up a bit. Okay, thanks, Miko. That's great. <laughs> okay, so here's our feather boas. Now we are gonna take off the tags, and they come with like a little hook on the ends, which is very cool. So I'm just gonna shove it through and wrap it around one of these little hooks. And I'm just going to go from there, 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 in a zigzag pattern and just hooking it along each of these little tabs. Now I come to the end and there's another little hook, so I hooked it on. Now when I start the next piece, I'll do the same thing. Instead of tying it in a knot or anything, it comes with, I know you love feathers. Sorry, no, no Miko, leave the feathers. So there's the hook. I'm gonna start on this side and then I get Miko. Yeah, I know you're helping. Yes, you look after that stuff. That'd be great. <clears throat> okay, just keep zigzagging it around. And then hook that again. I got these, by the way, for $1.25 each at the dollar store. Okay. Yes, Nico, I'm sure I don't need help with the feathers. Thank you, though. So there, we're almost done. Just uh, making sure it's... The last one is all together and hooked in properly. And there we go, pretty, right? Okay, so step two, I'm gonna secure the neon light string battery pack to the back. This is a neon light set that I got from the dollar store. I think it was $4 from the Dollarama. So I love that it has a little hook, so I'm gonna flip it over. I'm just gonna hook it on to the frame on the back. Just like that. And then we'll start wrapping the string light, just kind of willy-nilly around. Gonna make sure that it's all even. All right, and don't forget to hit the like, share, and subscribe buttons below. If you want to see more from Nico and I, 
Okay, so now I'm taking a pipe cleaner and I'm just uh, tying the end piece to uh, the starting piece so that it's secure and doesn't unwind off the wreath. There we go. And there. Now you could leave it just like this or you can dress it up a bit by step three, make and attach a decorative bow. I've, I know, Mako. I've done a polka dot, pink and white polka dot one right here. Bow tutorial links are in the description block box below if you're interested in seeing those. I'm just doing this one really quick. This is uh, not a wire um, ribbon, so it's a little harder to work with, but I did think it was very cute, so it's a little satin ribbon, so I'm trying it out. Here's the tails. Just going to attach those. With, of course, my handy dandy pipe cleaner, like so. Give it a little twist. And I'm going to put it right at the top of the heart. Okay, now flip it over and just adjust your ribbon. Once again, because it's not the wired ribbon, it's a little harder to work with, I found. But uh, I did think it was really cute still, so it's just a little harder, which is fun. Flip it up. And once again, you could leave it just like that. However, oh, dovetail. Oh, there we go, wrong way again, Kim. Hashtag lefty struggles. All right, there we go. Now we got a dovetail. And do the other side. And as I was saying, you could leave it like that. Sometimes left, uh, less is more, but more is more for me. So I have these felt words. So I think I'm going to add that and these foam hearts to the project. And I got the stick of uh, foam hearts for I think it was a dollar twenty-five or a dollar fifty from the dollar store. And I'm just going to use the big one and put a bit of glue there and hold it down so it's in the center of the bow. And I've already attached the uh, love word at the bottom. And I think that's all I'm going to do. So just let that dry like so. And there we have it, all done. Okay, YouTube DIYers, thank you so much for joining Miko and I for today's video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do us a favor and hit the like, share, and subscribe buttons below. And what's that? Of course, of course they're gonna do that. They will they like to see you absolutely okay and hope to see you next time on live in my left life diy creation say bye miko bye everyone cheers okay thanks for watching everybody don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe buttons below